Metastatic melanoma is actually the most common cancer-causing death in young adults in Australia. When I was a young registrar, I did a three-month rotation at Westmead Hospital. I admitted a young female patient my age, only 28 years old. None of the treatment that we had given her worked. She was dying. Those three months determined what I wanted to be for the rest of my life, and I became a medical oncologist. And I asked the question, why? Why were some patients given a second chance in life and others weren't? What I wanted to achieve through research was to figure out a way to offer the best type of treatment for that individual patient, and that is what we did. We decided to look at liquid biopsies, essentially a blood test. We found that circulating DNA detected in blood predicted response and outcome of immune therapy faster and more effectively than any other test currently available in clinical practice. When we admitted that 28-year-old female under our care six years ago, we could have offered her this blood test to choose the best treatment available to her at the time. And that is what research into personalised cancer medicine is all about, because we're all worth it. Mm -hmm.